Hi, welcome Sixty Graphics. My name is CGDG60. Uh, today we are continuing with our tutorial of building our beautiful software, Farmers Inventory Database Management. But uh, it looks like uh, not we we made the like, last tutorial, but I have made some customization for this form. Uh, that's to make it better, and we will continue to make some customization for this form. But let me show you what uh, I have added here. I, I have added some buttons. I take some button here and put into the behind the text box here and make it uh, with the same color and the, and same margin so it look like the beautiful up like so. So when let, let me take an example here. So when I take this button here, uh, when I drag this button here, you see this is the text box this is the button so the button uh into i have disabled the data enabled it so we're going to data and put it here not enabled you don't know you put it no then you just uh put it behind the text box so that's how uh, I, I i i i made um today we are going to see some logics here mm. Let me show. So we, we 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 will code for uh, check for refresh. Okay, delete button and undo. And some techniques for delete. Uh, we want to, when the customer is active, uh, so it will pop up the message. Uh, this customer is active, and you can't delete the active customer. So let us start from the uh, from this one from do. Uh, the code from undo uh, is very simple. Just me dot undo. That's all. So here, you see, me dot undo, me dot undo. That's simple. Okay, me dot undo. That is simple. Okay, you are finished. Then uh, refresh button is also is me dot refresh, me dot refresh. That is over. Okay. We make it uh, short uh, because uh, I have written some codes, so uh, that's really mm, will not annoy you. Uh, I've seen some members uh, saying that they are being annoyed by lighting with slow hand, like so. So now I have written uh, the code already, so I will show you how uh, the code the meaning of the of the code. Uh, that's all. So we are going to take uh, the big deal for this delete button. Uh, the delete button will um, will have the relationship with the active is active. Okay, text box, the ticky box. So let's see the, our code here. So uh, we have check first to verify if the uh, the the customer is active. So now if the if me dot active uh, this one uh, this one me dot active uh, if me dot active is true is true means is ticked then what to do okay the the text box will pop up and I uh, uh, told you 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 cannot delete active customer okay like so so let us test this one okay uh, let us test this one okay let us test here um this is a active customer okay this is the active customer so let us delete this active customer do you see uh it say that uh you cannot delete active customer okay so i can't delete it oh yeah that's all so let us continue so when is not active now uh we put else here else if the customer is not active that that we can say that if me dot i is active is equal to false here yeah. uh that's the meaning of else so if message box so we want to put some confirmation for the uh for the user uh for to ask you do you want to delete this customer yeah i want to delete it okay so now we we want to put some confirmation uh, for this uh, uh, user. So if message box, are you sure you want to delete this customer? So if the the user click yes button, then the the data will be will be deleted. And 
if the user uh, click no uh, for that uh, text box button then the message box will pop up the operation aborted and the code will, will exit so we stop execute okay so let us test that one okay let's go now here uh-huh now uh this is uh is active so now let us make this uh we, let us unlock this one uh we have been locked the uh, let us unlock in order to make uh the re re reference here so let us put this in in active inactive so when i click delete so you, 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 you the text box will pop up and says are you sure you want to delete this customer so when i click yes this customer will be deleted when i click no uh you see it uh says uh, operation is aborted and i click yes this customer will remain here safe and sound that's all okay uh that's all to for this uh customer form uh the next tutorial we are we will be doing uh sales order uh sales order details we will build a form for sales and uh, we will be doing some modification of color and uh, everything for any any form uh in order to make the our app to be beautiful okay thank you my name is gdg6 don't forget to subscribe and like and comment uh this is our channel for software development